In the post-COVID age, one arborvita child care center is trying to help your children get off the screen and into the garden. But they're facing challenges after the recent cut to child care funding. Our own Isabella Lisco has more. <laughs> Terry's Treehouse is a child care program that values learning outdoors. We get to go in the garden and play and we get to pick stuff from the garden. The garden may be thriving, but the school faces challenges. Program director and Northwoods native Emily May King says the program relies heavily on the COVID era child care counts fund, which was recently cut from the state budget. Funding will completely dry up in January, impacting teachers and families. Um, I worked really hard to get my staff um, the benefits they deserve. So what's going to happen is that, that that overhead is going to have to be the parent's responsibility. A responsibility to pay for a service, King says, is undervalued by society. She says child care is more necessary than ever because both parents need to work. We have to really change our mindset that a family, one income, cannot make it anymore. While also considering the importance of early development. All the research shows now that the first five years is the most brain development a person is going to have in their entire life. King knows firsthand these opportunities change lives. Um, I was a young mom, and um, having those teachers and those relationships um, really supported me in my growth and my journey and supporting my children. And if you can just do that, or you can support one family, that's a big difference. And that, that's why I'm still here. That's why we're still here, because we know it's important work and um, it will be valued one day. <laughs> the kids value Miss Emily in their own way. We like that she's a garden girl and we like that she um, grows all of these plants so we can eat them. Terry's Treehouse encourages people to continue calling, writing letters, and advocating for child care funding. More information can be found at terrystreehouse.com. For Newswatch 12, I'm Isabella Lisco.